Hello! In this example, we are going to round some numbers. Now, the process for rounding numbers is fairly simple, and it involves two things. The first thing is you want to identify what place value you want to round the number. The second thing you need to do is to just check the number off to the right of where you want to round the number. Now, if the second number is, say, 5 or higher, you are going to change your number to the next highest one. Now, if your number is 4 or lower, you're just going to leave the number as it is. Let's see how this process works out with these two examples. So, in this first number, I want to round it to the 10,000 spot. Well, as I look at my number, the digit in the 10,000 spot is this 5 here. So, if that's where I want to round it, I'm going to look to the number just off to the right the 3. Now notice how this 3 falls into that category of 4 or lower. That means that what I want to do to round this number is actually just leave the 5 as it is. With all the rest of the numbers, I'm going to replace them with a 0. This is known as rounding down because if I look at this new number I formed, 50,000, it is less than my original number. Not too bad, huh? Let's do this one more time. Here I have the number 4,642,069. I want to round this one to the millions spot. It would be this 4 guy. Again, I look to the guy just to the right, the 6, to determine what I need to do with this 4. Well, this 6 falls into the category of 5 or higher, which means rather than keep the 4, I'm going to bump that up one number. So from 4, it changes to a 5. Now, in much the same way, all these other numbers get replaced by a 0. This is known as rounding up because the new number I've just formed, 5 million, is larger than my original one. And there you go. All you really have to do is identify your place value, check the number to the right, and then round appropriately. If you'd like to see some more videos, please visit MySecretMathTutor.com.